Why is the AstraZeneca vaccine apparently safe for older people? First of all, I want to emphasize that the data shows that for the vast majority of people, the AstraZeneca COVID vaccine is both safe and reliable. But in extremely rare cases, it has also been linked to the development of potentially dangerous blood clots. Um, there's been a scientific scramble to, to try to figure out exactly what's going on. And experts now think that in those rare individuals, substances produced by the immune system in response to the vaccine can also activate platelets in the blood, which, which leads to the clotting. Um, because it happens so rarely, the statistics aren't conclusive, um, but women under the age of 50 seem to be affected most often. Um, that's led national health authorities in some countries with a range of vaccine options to begin recommending the AstraZeneca vaccine primarily to those over the age of 60, where, where links to clotting were, were not completely absent, but much, much more tenuous. It's pretty amazing, actually, that we discovered these needles in a haystack so quickly, and, and also that we already have a pretty good explanation for, for what might be causing them. Um, I couldn't find any studies explaining in, in metabolic terms exactly uh, why this particular side effect seems to impact older people less often than it does younger ones. But, but many experts think that the idea that the clotting is basically caused by an immune response, that that could explain it. Um, we know that as people age, their immune responses tend to dampen down. And, and in this particular case, uh, that could be a good thing. And with all the other data we have about the AstraZeneca vaccine showing it to be safe and effective, uh, it remains a very powerful tool in our arsenal for protecting the elderly in particular, uh, who are most at risk if they catch COVID-19, um, hence the recommendation that they continue to receive it.